Mackey Motors in Lake City is the place to find new and certified used vehicles. With a knowledgeable sales staff and amazing service departments, you'll drive away satisfied. Find new roads at Mackey Motors in Lake City, MackeyMotors.com. Carson Peters of the Glitter Ralston golf team joining us here, and we also got Ethan Oberding to my back. We'll talk with Carson first here. Uh, Carson, cold day out here in Greene County. Started off cold, got a little bit warmer as things went on, but uh, talk to me about your performance out here at Greene County. Um, I was hitting my driver well today. My irons were really there, and uh, putting shaved a lot of strokes off for me today. I know this weather really didn't play anyone any favors, so talk to me just about playing these conditions and how you kind of combated it. Um, you really had to play the wind, watch the left to right. But otherwise, it wasn't too bad with distance. It was just mainly left and right wind. What were some of those holes that really kind of affected you and caught you off guard? Uh, first hole, so five. That was pretty harsh with the left to right wind. But my putting made up for it. I was going to say, today you get a runner-up medalist, 44 overall. Um, talk to me about your performance. Surprised by that result? Yeah, I mean, I got Ethan over here to help me in practice. I normally like to go up against him just because mm -hmm. he is a little bit better and he has that experience, but it's just fun to go up against him in practice. What are some things you've learned from Ethan so far? Um, pretty much just keep your head down and swing, fall through, just stay confident. Don't let it get to your head. Talk to me about the best parts of your game here today. Where do you feel you're at your strongest? Probably my putting. I had a couple of big putts from a long ways away, and that shaved a lot off. This course uh, kind of flat on some areas, kind of hilly on others. Um, what were your best holes here today? Probably, I don't know, two was nice. Two was a good hole. Four was a good hole back there. That was nice and straight. Hit my driver well. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, scoring a 44 here today. Have you hit your goal, or what kind of goals have you set yourself this season? I'd like to get 40s. 44 around there so yeah i hit my goal so you're on the right track if over yeah. here absolutely we'll tell you what carson thanks so much for joining us we'll slide yep. ethan over here yep. into our broad and into our interview spot uh ethan first of all really good uh golfing by this team here today maybe not get the team win but i think overall had some really nice scores um talk about your performance out here today how did uh, it go i started off strong and then uh once the cold hit I kind of went downhill. Uh, <laughs> it, it wasn't really playing anyone any favors at all. Um, so that wind was kind of affecting you. That cold was bitter. And now, of course, it's kind of mocking you now that the sun is out a little bit. Um, it, talk to me just about how you were trying to combat that because I know you guys are out there not really moving a lot. So what were you kind of trying to do to combat the wind and the cold? Uh, well, I saw some of us doing some jumping jacks on the course. Keep warm a little bit. <laughs> and then, uh, I mean, I would keep moving. Not really stand still that much. <laughs> uh, talk to me just about your strongest points here today. Where do you feel like you're at your strongest? Uh, from 100 out, I was doing pretty good. I was tripping on. And then I didn't work on putting a little bit. I was an iffy. Uh, hearing Carson just say that, you know, he's learned so much for you and you guys have a friendly competition. Um, what is the competition amongst your guys? Uh, do you guys see yourself in competition during practice or what is it kind of like amongst you guys? Uh, yeah, we definitely have competition in practice. We uh, play for who's better and stuff. And then, uh, so like between me and John, it's see so you can hit the driver the farthest. And Carson's like chipping, so you can do better than that. Talk to me about just this, this course overall for those who might not know it. Uh, parts, it's kind of hilly, kind of not. This is more one of the more flat courses we've seen around this area. Yeah, it's pretty straight up and down, uh, pretty straight. Not, yeah, there's some hills. Over there on the part three, I got stuck on a hill, mm -hmm. hit it, and then rolled all the way back down. So yeah, it's pretty straightforward though. Nice course. Ethan, talk to me about your goals here for this season. What is kind of the score you want to get at consistently? Uh, I want to be golfing below 40. I want to break 40 and then stay there around that far area. Perfect. There we go. I tell you what, Ethan, thanks so much for joining us, and we'll see you later down the road. Thank you.